how to use x-ray vision. First you'll note we've got x-ray glasses, that's F3. Um, you also note that the bucket is in the air seven inches above grade. So if we want to go into x-ray vision, we hit the F3 button there. Oops. That's going to take us to the first menu page. The F3 button just flashes right through. You go to the x-ray page, back to your home page, back to the menu page. So it's very simple one touch stuff. Plum. This is plum above your top of utility. You've got different ways to input your utility. Uh, the main way is when you start out, you hand dig or sewer probe down to your utility. You know the height. You know what plum is vertically above it and you put that distance in. In this case I've got a little model and I've got a broomstick and plum over that broomstick. I'm going to put it at basically 5 inches, 9, 90%, so 6 inches. Next thing is utility size. It's about a 1 inch broomstick. Uh, next thing is radius. Uh, we're going to put a safety radius around it where it starts beeping because we're getting close of 6 inches. So it's completely around the broomstick six inches away. Then you're gonna have kill hydraulics. If you've got the hydraulics kill hooked up, you can tell it how far away you want it to kill. In this case, I'm putting zero, so if I, when I touch it, it kills it. Um, I could put two inches, and then when I got within two inches of the broomstick, it would lock up my hydraulics. So the next page then is just hit F3, and you see your x-ray page. Let me explain this to you. Let's start at the bottom real simple. Seven inches, if you remember the first page, and we flip over, our grade was seven inches down to grade. So if we come back through here, seven inches. So it always tells us what our grade is because since we switched into this new page. Next thing is you've got five inches. This is our plumb input. So there's different ways to uh, find the utility or put it into the computer. First one, five inches, we set it five inches above basically. Um, so we would hold our bucket five inches above the top of utility. Um, this is for, as you're getting closer, one foot. So you just up and down with the arrows here and you can change it. You see it turning yellow, one foot, or you can get down to where you touch the top of the utility. So you've dug it up, it's in space, you know exactly where it is. You take your bucket, you put it right above the top of the utility, almost touch it, and you just click enter so um, I've already done this so it's pretty simple then you got safety on or off and that just changes by moving the left arrow or the right arrow uh, this is for the hydraulics so when you get uh, your hydraulics uh, the, the stop hydraulics when they get within say we said at two inches we have a zero in this case um, it's on when it gets within two inches it will lock up your hydraulics you have to hit off so that you can move away and do what you're gonna do. Uh, in 60 seconds, that'll turn back on, or you can manually turn it back on just like that. So it's on right now. Away is from your teeth of your bucket. This is how far away it is right now from the outside, the red dots, the broomstick. Uh, the safety radius is around, it's always two inches bigger, uh, uh, where, where it's a solid beep, two inches bigger than what we um, set our um, stop dig at so in this case we had a zero the outside of the pipe so it's two inches bigger so um this is how far away the teeth are so no matter how you move the bucket as you see me move here when i hit the first and it doesn't matter what part of the bucket you hit on the beeping as i get closer and closer closer and closer beeps faster and faster but my teeth if you see right there it's two inches away that's only my tooth. It's one inch away. Back up, okay, come back. So if I get too close, as you get into that safety area, be solid. If I actually touch the utility, it'll flash. That means you've been electrocuted or whatever you've been through. So that, that sets the end of it there. I'm in the Samos Greece right now working, so it's kind of different. So, anyways, so on this screen, you can see you've got your elevation that you've got to go down to grade. You can see the piping work all the way around it. Anything that touches the bucket will give you beeping all the way to stop dig. Your teeth give the distance away to what it is. And you also have another feature called zoom. F2, F3 is the one that switches the page. F4 zooms in. 
and F5. Zooms out, you might be in a gigantic machine digging up a gigantic pipe. You might be a gigantic machine digging up a little teeny weeny pipe. So, as you push that in, you can zoom on and on. You can see the bucket, that's the angle. That's the safety area around the bucket that's been measured. Um, where the end of the stick is, it actually shows you a stick so you don't hit the utility with it. But it's uh, that point and that point of the two pins exactly for the size. This is a little mini S square, so kind of see the stick out there in space for the size of this. That's the way uh, our uh, safety dig works, x-ray vision. Thank you.